Good morning, good morning. Except I don't really know if it's morning anymore. It might be afternoon. I am hanging out. It is the day off. My day off. Um, I did catch up on Instagram this morning. Nola's all comfy. I don't want to make her move. Anyway, I did that. I posted finally about the premiere. Sorry. About the premiere. Wait, this is the first clip. Hang on. do that. I finally posted about the Rise and Rumble premiere because I finally got those photos so I posted about that. Um, I switched out Nola's litter box. I put the new one out. I threw the old one away um, and I am convinced that that cat litter has changed its recipe. There is something different about that cat litter because it is supposed to clump and it does not and it has not for a very long time. So I think that's part of the reason why it was getting all stuck to the bottom and gross and whatever because it's not clumping. Anyway, that's that. I am sitting on the couch. I am finally catching up on the Solis' vlogs. I am like three weeks behind, so I'm catching up. And then I'm going to read my book. It is 6.20 p.m. I have finally sat down and read this entire book. It is 460 pages. It took me like five hours. And it ended, I knew it was going to end on a cliffhanger, but I hoped it wasn't going to be that bad. <sighs> oh my gosh, it was so, it was so good. It was so good. But now I'm going to have to wait forever for the second one. I am a little mad at myself though, because I just used my stamp to um, do those. But I screwed them up because they weren't fully on the table. And so this one looks awful. Um, and that's my signed copy, but that's fine. Because it's not like I ever plan on getting rid of them. Um, and then this one is the one I actually physically read. This is the Barnes & Noble. And that one's a little smudged. That one's not as bad. But I just, I had the books like this and it was dumb. But anyway, voila. I just realized I was, I thought I was vlogging and I wasn't. Now, first of all. The next book I'm reading. Um, it's called Dream a Little Dream. Craziest thing about it is that, once again, these are random, randomly generated. Craziest thing about it, the second and third book I just picked up at the last um, book sale I went to. Because it was they were like a dollar each. And I was like, mm, I usually don't get later runs in the series, but they have both of them. Why not? So... I hope I'll like it though. It sounds like I will. You see, and this is precisely what I knew what would happen, which is good because I would have this one day off, you know, finally can get this day off. <sighs> I'm not leaving my house. I'm not doing anything. And by the end of today, I'm like, wow, I'm bored. I literally just got up and I went to my kitchen and I was like, no, I was like, no, you're not hungry. You're bored. Sit down. <laughs> Stop. So... I played a little bit of my video game, but as I said, I'm still at that point where there's not a ton that I can really do. Um, I mean, it's getting later. It's dark now, so at least I can go to bed soon. But, like, it's good. It helps kind of reset where I was like, wow, I had the day where I didn't really have to do anything. And that's all I needed. Tomorrow I will have work as normal, but then I am actually going to go and see one of my... Um, one of my friends, the person, that, one of the people I volunteer at church with in her high school production of Little Shop. Um, and yeah, that'll be really nice because having two days in a row of being home the entire day, it will be nice to like after work, get out of the house briefly to go and do that. So that's nice. Um, but yeah, I might start reading a little bit of this book. I don't really know. Because I don't really feel like watching anything either. Like, I don't really want to turn anything on. Because I kind of dedicated five hours of my day today to reading a huge book. And while it was very enjoyable, that did take up a lot of mental energy. So, I don't know. I have decided, though, after reading this book series, which I hope I will enjoy, 
I'm going to reread the Shatter Me series again because I have to reread it like every year. It's just so good. I can't not. I mean, I might skip past the, um, whatchamacallit, the um, novellas. That, no, I probably won't. I was going to say I might skip past the novellas this time, but it's just such a good series. So I am sad to say that I got 68 pages into this. Not good. However, I did learn that the original books are apparently in German. And I think they just did a really terrible job translating it. Because the writing isn't good. And I realize now it's because it was translated badly. But unfortunately, the story... The story is also just too slow. There's not enough happening for me to like huh, want to keep reading which is a bummer because I had really high hopes for it um it sounded right up my alley but unfortunately it just really sounds like the English translation they just they butchered it in other news I'm a little scared that I hear gunshots not close by I feel like I hear him. Those are... I, I really do think that's what those are. I haven't really heard those here. I'm a little stressed. Or maybe it was a car. Because, you know, cars can kind of do that, too. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to go to bed. Unfortunately, since this series didn't work out, that means it's time to reread the Shadow Me series. I was not hoping that this series would fail. I wanted to like it, but that didn't happen. Anyway, I'm heading to bed because it's like 11. So thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. All my social media is in the description of you all.